Hey, what is going on guys? This is gonna go for all iPads. Basically, you wanna be able to transfer photos and videos from your iPad directly to the hard drive of your Chromebook. I'm gonna show you how. Very, very easy. So obviously the first thing that you're gonna need, you're gonna need one of these cables with a USB-A and then whatever your connector for your iPad is, okay? This is the newest iPad Pro here and they have a USB Type-C here. Actually, this one comes with a USB Type-C to a USB Type-C. So I had to use one of my extra USB A's because the Chromebooks don't have a USB Type C or a Thunderbolt uh, connector. But you guys, if you have an older uh, iPad, then you probably want to use the USB A to a, a Lightning port. Okay. Anyways, again, mine's the newest um, iPad, so it's the uh, takes a USB Type C. So let me go ahead and plug one in into my USB port. And now I'll plug the other end into here. And now I have it plugged in. Now, as soon as you log in, you should get this message here. It says, allow this device to access photos and videos. I'm gonna go ahead and click on allow. Now watch my Chromebook here. As soon as uh, I type in okay, now this um, file here, or this this is the My Files window. It's basically the same thing as like an Explorer, like in a Windows PC. Anyways, you always get this message here that pops up here, uh, ready to back up the Google Drive. I'm not talking about uploading your um, photos and videos to the Google Drive or cloud. I'm talking about saving it directly to the hard drive of the Chromebook, okay? So anyways, here is a Apple iPad right here. Underneath it is DCIM, and then you should have a bunch of folders in here depending on how many um, photos and videos you have. I don't have many photos or videos on this, uh, this iPad, but if I double click on here, I can see some photos and videos here, all right? Now take note, you know, with a, um, a MacBook or a Windows computer, you can drag and drop it onto the desktop. You're not able to do that with a Chromebook, okay? So with a Chromebook, you can see the first uh, folder here is called My Files, and below it is Downloads folder. That is the hard drive of our uh, Chromebook, okay? So we, technically what you can do is you can double-click on these, uh, or you can drag and drop these photos into the Download folder, okay? Or what I would recommend is, well, let me just move a, a, a folder. or Here's one photo. I'll drop it into the Downloads folder here. And then you can see when I click that downloads folder, you can see that photo is right there. Okay, but this is what I recommend. Just go down and open up another window and we'll make a new folder down here. So we'll go ahead and open up a new window under my files right here. Click on that. And then right here, it says my files. Basically, it's like the drive of the hard drive of the Chromebook. Here's downloads. Let's go to my files here and let's just create a new folder here. And let's call this Jack. Okay, and that's where we're gonna put our, all our photos and uh, videos. So let me go ahead and double click on Jack here. So now, if I go back to the uh, 100 Apple folder where all my photos are, now what I can do from here, I can just drag and drop. Okay, I can, here's a movie file here. I can drag and drop it. You can usually see something down here. It says copy in so-and-so. Or I can go ahead and just, I'll go ahead and click a, Hold down shift. I'll go ahead and drag and drop all of these onto my new folder called Jack that's on my hard drive of my Chromebook. Okay, well, there you go. So now all of these photos and videos are actually on my hard drive of my Chromebook. Okay, so pretty simple. Any questions, issues, just comment below. All right, see you guys in the next one.